Allowed by my say, yeah. But again, I English explanation. Hey guys, and we're back. We're back, Samu. Oh, guys, back there. I've been on the show. Once again, we're back, and today we're gonna do project 8 and project 10. But, because I can't say it's like a project, can I go to the me? What's that term? Sir? Innovate. Uh, innovate. Ito tawa niyo. Kanang hilata ng nipon. Joyce. Joyce. Lizzo. Lizzo. <laughs> okay, so let's start for our first project, which is Project 8. So here we go. So first, Project 8 is called the Moodland. And what we're gonna do here is we're gonna just upload the code. Kaya, syempre, ready na ang code. Para ang code. Ready na siya. Okay na ito naman. So also, our setup para makita mo here. Here is our setup and upload the amount code. So this is what it looks like. So what will happen there is Kanisha ang code sa laptop is I mean ang code sa Arduino is mag generate lang siya random value. So So okay na project 8. The difference of project 8 and project 10 is that a project 8 random input siya from the computer and, and project 10 is inputted through serial monitor. So let's start with the project 10, upload the code and here we go. So let's try to upload the code to Project 10 and here we go. Oh my gosh. Hi sir. Hi sir. Hi sir. Hi sir. <laughs> okay, so for the Project 10, the input comes from you, the user. So how do we upload a value to the Arduino through serial? So let's open up serial monitor. So mo niya may tabo. So ang mga buwato na ni char R B G. So let's input any random number from zero to two two five five. So for so for example, let's try to input red. Actually, na upload ng code. So after na upload ng code, nothing will happen. Okay, you have to input the value for yourself. So let's start with the red. Let's just say pila na pila pila. One hundred. Blue is uh, 100. 50. Okay, kusa Okay, lang. Kusa ten na lang with 10. Green is 200. Ay, 255 na lang. So, if ato niya siya isend, isend na to. So, what will happen na ni? Kumpay, kumpay. Ay. Here you go. Actually, gabi ka kaya gamili. Kusa ni dang Kusag mong gorang bumbili sa blue, so it's okay. So, ang pinaka highest value na to is green, which is 255, which is sakto kay haya doon green. So, if we're gonna change the values, red atong i 255. Ay, no space, red is 255. Uh, blue is uh, 200 na lang para haya doon blue. Green is let's just say 10 na lang. So, yun ay ang green. So, 1, 2, 3, upload. There you go. Kusog yung blue, my gosh. And for our last activity for today, Innovated. So, muna siya mong gamitin. So, kanya siya, this is actually a potentiometer. Two potentiometers. Makita man sa kili do. See? X and Y axis. So why not we'll just grab the values and atong gamiton for the LED. So let's try. Okay, so we've hooked up the analog joystick and it's time to upload the code. So here we go. Let's start the start fading. Here we go. So we need an code graphic simple, so short, marag siya, marag short. <laughs> okay, so let's try to upload the code and see what happens. Okay, there you go. There you go. If you want to play with the joystick, there you go. And dancing light. Tuck, 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 So I don't think I have to explain the code. Okay, the code says for itself. As you can see, the code is very simple. It's very easy to understand. So, it's very easy to understand. So, I think that's it for our project. So, mag-tugs-tugs sa midi. Tugs-tugs-tugs. Bye, guys. Bye. Tugs-tugs-tugs.